Welcome back to some Clash on the Clash. Today we're going to be using the Mojo, Mojo and Mad Cat's controller R to have a look at some of the war events. I'm really upset in two ways. Number one is we lost and we got destroyed. Number two, I can't show you my replays uh, because they were too long ago. But as you can see here, right here, you three starred and you three starred. I had some insane overkill dragon raids for you, but sadly I can't show you them, which is really upsetting. So we're going to have to have a look at some other ones, uh, some other raids. But as you can see, uh, we did get pretty much destroyed. Uh, this is because a lot of people were leaving and we also uh, removed quite a few people from the clan that weren't active. Which means we've got a massive spot of about 12 spaces for new active players. So if you're over level 70, you're active and you're good, make sure you come check us out. We are open at the moment. The clan is open for invites. So make sure you send an invite and hopefully we'll be accepting some of you guys in. So, since we can't view any of our, um, any of our or my raids, we're going to have a look at some other people's raids and see how they did. So we want to have a look at some of the higher levels. So we're going to have a look here, not a high level, but we've got a two-star here from Knight Antingen. Uh, and let's have a look and see how well he did. Hopefully he did uh, pretty good. Obviously he did, he got the two-star. But I'm not sure, I haven't watched any of these back. So it looks like he's attacking from the bottom right with the wall breakers there. What's he got in his, there we go. Here comes his clan castle. What's he got? He's got some archers popping out. Those are, uh, the wall breakers just keep on dying though as soon as they get in there. So that's kind of, kind of frustrating for him to be honest. And now he waits. Is he playing the waiting game? Uh, there's nobody else. I know he gets two stars, so he's got to move somehow soon. But he is playing the waiting game. Out comes a golem, uh, which is a bit of a beast. And then he brings out Harry Potter. Some more golems and barbarians, and everybody is now coming out of the clan castle. There's a few more wizards left in there. I hope he's got a lightning spell uh, to finish them off, but he looks like he's going to be able to do it with his wizards anyway, and his king as well. His king's going pretty ham on them, uh, but his king's about to die. His king is dead in three, two, one. Goodbye, king. Oh, no, wait. He's not dead. There we go. Now he's dead, so he died pretty, pretty soon after. And so it looks like he did the uh, go white strategy here as you can see the peckers are being dropped as well uh, so he's done a go wipe he's dropped in his archer queen now uh, the wizards are going around the outside which uh, is not necessarily a good thing but it's not a bad thing uh, but as you see he's throwing in some wall breakers as well and uh, more wizards are going around the right hand side there and he's pushing through the center quite nicely i can't uh, here's peckers his peckers are up here on the right uh, i believe he's got one or two in the center here as well his golem is looking like an absolute tank He's taken out the town hall, and he's about to get 50%. He gets 50% on this. We have destroyed it. So he's got his two-star now uh, using the go-wipe strategy. It's worked really well for him, and that was a pretty good raid. He's been able to get right down the center here. That's what I like about it, is that, you know, it hasn't kind of flushed out. Okay, he's got a few wizards going around the side, uh, and, you know, he's destroying more stuff. But that is a clear path straight through to the town hall there, which was really effective. And obviously, it's really effective because, I mean, it's worked. He's, he's got the two stars that he needed. And uh, it looks like it's only the golem left, and the golem slowly dies in five seconds. Let's skip this over, and there we go. Golem's dead. So that worked pretty well. Uh, he did really well there. He obviously got his two stars, which is great, uh, and helped us out a bit. But obviously, sadly, we uh, we are a little bit far behind here. So let's have a look at some other raids that we can view. Let's go into the war events. Let's go and see if there are any uh, really good uh, defenses from our team. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's anything really powerful, like a really good defense. So Owen here uh, has defended on a, is that a 49%? I can't quite read it from here because it's quite far away. Looks like it said 49%, but this can be quite interesting. Let's have a look. So this is a minute 30. He spawns all his dragons in the exact same spot. I don't know if that's a wise tactic. I always like to spread them around. Uh, not like over a massive bit, but like spread them a little bit. But he's gone for them all in the same spot. Uh, and they seem to be getting pretty destroyed by uh, the air defense, uh, the multi-target inferno tower, the expo. I didn't know the expos could shoot uh, into the air because I've never never tackled an expo before. But otherwise, it's going pretty well. He's probably thinking, yeah, this is going all right. I mean, these guys going around the outside, which I don't think he wanted. That's why he spawned them all in the center here, was to try and get them to go around the top. Uh, all the dragons have died that were around the left. And now he's starting to lose momentum. He's got quite a few here. They're almost going like around it. They're going like around the base. And it looks like they're going to go and attack the center. Um, but they're coming up now. This guy down here knows what to do. He's going around the outside being sensible. 
His Archer Queen's just been taken down. And he's probably thinking he's going to get the one star here. But up pops a Tesla. Tesla's doing some damage. And out come the minions. That's a really bad place to put the clan castle. Uh, in my eyes. But it's worked for him. I'm not going to say anything because it's technically worked for him. But I would put my clan castle on the inside. And then we got one dragon left. And he is going to die. 47%. I think this was a 49%. Or 48%. That is unbelievable. Is he going to get this one? 49%. He must have been so upset. That is crazy. Well done, Owen, on that defense. You literally have just won it, uh, which is pretty insane. Uh, it's a pretty close one, obviously, to do, but, I mean, it is really good fun, uh, especially when you get those kind of defenses. I mean, when you're attacking and you get 49%, it's the most annoying thing ever. Literally, it's so annoying. All right, let's see if we can find a three-star on... Oh, I'm trying to see if there's any of my base any anywhere. See if anyone attacked my base again. Uh, but I can't find anybody that attacked my base. No, and now we're going off off the zone anyway. All right, let's have a look at one of their three stars attacks on one of us. Um, because here we go. Oh my god, it is on Charlotte's base. So my girlfriend's base, but she's like level 30. So she's going to get wiped out by anybody. Uh, and this is, this is their attack on it. Let's see what they did. So they run out with first barbarians and archers. So I guess they're doing a barge tactic here, uh, which probably has worked really well for them. But I'm sorry, Charlotte. She's She's got destroyed. Look at them. They're just swarming around this base. This base is actually technically quite good. The clan castle should be on the inside. But for her level, this base is actually pretty good. Um, but obviously, she's getting attacked by higher levels. And, I mean, I'm not going to lie. She's never going to win this. Even with a barge tactic, uh, you're going to destroy her. Just because of the amount of stuff that they're throwing in. That is crazy. Look at the barbarians just... It's like they're just running around, like, having fun. They're in, like, a play park, just destroying everything. And she has just been swarmed on. Pretty pretty fast attack, that. We're on 92% already, and it looks like they're going to finish off with the town hall. Oh, my God. Look at that. That is crazy. And that is her destroyed. So, she got destroyed really quickly, but we all accept, uh, expected that anyway. I'm just really, really upset that I can't show you my, my raids. It's really, really annoyed me. Because uh, they were really cool raids. I made them so they would, would be cool for this. But I'm going to have to get on it faster. I'll have to do the video basically as the war ends. I'll have to do my videos. Alright, let's have a look. We'll watch one more raid. Looks here like uh, Bienno101 has, defe has um, defeated loads. Oh my god. Everybody attacked Bienno101. What is going on here? What is so fascinating? Oh, are you serious? Still going? What is fascinating about his his base? Let's have a look. So we're going to go watch one of these attacks. He's been one-starred by basically everybody on their team, uh, which which seems a bit crazy. Uh, okay. That... Did that just let me watch one that wasn't? I don't know. Um, oh, but, oh, okay. So his town hall's on the outside. That's that's an awful idea. But I don't know why everybody went for the one-star. I guess they get the, the bonus... Is what they've gone for there, but that's kind of annoying. That's kind of a lame excuse for a for a raid. You know what? We're gonna go and click onto our name anyway and see if it works because sometimes these things work and you don't expect it. Let's see if we can we, see if we can catch a replay. Let's go down. Come on. If we can end on one of my replays, it'd be amazing. Where am I? There's me. Oh, that's where I got de destroyed there. That's kind of upsetting. <laughs> I got three starred there. Joe three starred someone, which is really good job. Um, and here's mine. So let's see if we can watch it. No, it's not working. Sometimes, like, they save them and it works, but it didn't work that time. Uh, and we can't watch any of these in the end. So there we go, guys. That is going to be the end of this Clash on the Couch. I'm sorry I couldn't show you any of my raids or my defenses, but the replays don't hold enough. They really should hold a little bit longer, but sadly they don't. I hope you guys are having a great Friday. Um, tomorrow and Sunday, I'm going to be away at G3. So if you're at G3, I can meet you there. Uh, but there will be pre-recorded videos over the weekend for you guys including some awesome raids. So again, thank you so much for the support. The last video got over a 1,000 likes in the first day. If this could match that, I will be over the moon. So get liking, guys. Comment down below on any other raids you want me to see uh, want to see me do in Clan Wars, not just like a general raid, just in Clan Wars itself. And hopefully I'll get them done in the next war. But until next episode, guys, thank you so much for watching. Peace out.